guys, it's Allie. So today we're gonna be doing another wig review. As you guys can tell, I finally got my roots done. Um, maybe I'll come up with a hair update because I don't know what I'm doing for my hair anymore and I'm tired of the pink, it's so annoying. So anyways, today we're gonna be reviewing a wig I got from Amazon. The reason why I got this wig was because everyone's wet dream is Hayley Williams. Personally, uh, she's not mine. Next to the big titty goth GF is Hayley Williams. So I already turned myself into a big titty goth GF. Now I have to turn myself into Hayley Williams. <laughs> Just kidding. But anyways, apparently being a redhead is super hot. So I was like, you know what? Let's try it out. So the wig is called Leave-In Curly Bob Wig with Bands 14 inch orange. I paid like $25 for this wig. So it wasn't really expensive. And I actually got this wig uh, months ago. So I pre-washed it and I'm gonna brush it out. So we're gonna see if this wig is recommendable. I'm pretty sure that this wig came with a wig cap and probably another accessory, but you guys know I have a bajillion wig caps. So this is what the wig looks like uh, at the parting. So I don't know, I guess it looks kind of natural. And then you have the bangs with the curly hair strands. This one is really similar to the pink wig that I reviewed. If you guys want to go check that one out, I'll link it in the description. And if you guys want to go check out my other wig reviews, I do a lot of wig reviews. I'll put that in the description as well. So, so far it's actually really easy to brush out. Uh, the texture, oh, never mind. The wig itself is a synthetic wig. It's not real hair. Don't expect anything less for something that's $25. Uh, it's seemingly easy to brush, but there is, um, quite a bit of shedding so yeah so inside of the wig looks exactly like the pictures i feel like the wig looks exactly like all the pictures it has uh it looks about the same length and i thought it was gonna be a little thinner in the ends but it's actually it's a lot less stringy so that's interesting like there's just so much shedding you guys don't even see it but like there's just a lot of shedding all right so i'm gonna go put a wig cap on and we're gonna try this wig on and i'll let you guys know what i think Oh, hi, hey there, it's your local lunch lady. How's it going? All right, so let's try on the wig. It's actually really soft, but I'm a little bit upset that it sheds a lot and it kind of tangles. Okay. All right, you guys, good news. It fits my big head. Oh my goodness. Why do I look like Chucky? Okay, I had higher hopes for this wig. I'm so sorry, but this wig does not make me look like Hayley Williams. Well, if you want to be like Ginger Locks instead of Goldilocks. Ginger Locks and the Three Bears. Guys, never, ever, ever should I be a ginger. Not that there's anything wrong with being a ginger. Gingers are beautiful, but this, it will go, it will go. These are more like curtain bangs. These are not like actual bangs. Uh, false advertisement. Also, maybe because I have like a really short forehead, uh, bangs are not really great with wigs. Yeah, I'm gonna have to like definitely cut these bangs. Like they are way too long. So the wig is really soft. I actually like how it feels. Um, it's a soft synthetic plastic, but it is shedding like it's freaking Christmas. It's a lot thicker in the ends than in the pictures. The good news is that it fits my big head. You guys know I have a pretty large cranium. So luckily this one fits. It is adjustable. If you guys have a smaller head, you can make it smaller. Uh, so that's a great thing. I totally am going to cut this wig straighten it a little because I feel like these curls are way too unnatural. For the color, I'm gonna say it's cute. Um, I do feel like it's too, like the bangs are way too wig-like. They're very long. I am like, no one has bangs this long unless you're growing them out. So overall, if we're just looking at the wig raw, I'm gonna have to give it probably a I'll give it like an eight on 10, maybe like a seven on 10, only simply because I thought it was gonna look a lot more natural, like in the pictures, in the pictures it looks thin. So you get that like, the look that looks less wiggy. So would I recommend this wig? I would probably say yes, if you have some sort of cosplay to do with this. So also I'll show you guys what it looks like from the back. I don't know how natural this looks, but this is the back. 
I don't know. The wig is pretty good overall. I'm just like not feeling like, I don't know. I feel like the short haired version of Kim Possible. Unfortunately, it doesn't make me look like a hot lead singer, um, but um, I'll have to work that in. So this is the end of the review. If you guys want to see a little bonus, you guys can continue watching the video. As a bonus, I'm going to cut the wig and straighten it a little. So if you want to see me do that, um, continue watching. If not, I hope you guys like this review. I'll put the link to this wig in the description. So let's get down to business. Okay, so let's start with the evidential problem. All right, these bangs are way, 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 way. I always have interruptions, always. Can we go one video without an interruption, please? Mm. I expected this wig to be a lot more choppy, you know, like rebel-y looking, but like it literally just looks like, I don't know, a wig you would wear for like, I don't know, some kind of cosplay or something. This process is long and tedious, so I'm probably going to fast forward. So fast forward when this is all done. So I've come to realize that um, Haley Williams has a mullet um, and the more I cut like a mullet shape the more i look like her she has like really really short hair whereas like this is like still pretty long i don't know let's keep going i guess three hours later all right guys so this is as good as it's going to get i didn't straighten it completely i left it a little wavy and it's definitely not 100 percent the way i wanted it to be but it's honestly probably gonna be the best I could do for now. I do have places to go. So with the banks, it's not too bad. I think it's a lot better, but this wig is super bulky and yeah. Hopefully now this wig looks more like Haley Williams vibe, but that'll be the end for this video. I definitely need to cut more to give more of that like mullet look, but yeah. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay loyal, stay royal. Bye guys!